Action star Speed McCool at the 100th Annual Pork Belly Nut Festival. That's right, news talking guy. It's the time of year when all the squirrels in Pork Belly run to the park to dig up the nuts that they buried for the winter. And right now, across town, a parade filled with floats made entirely out of nuts will work its way here to kick off the running of the squirrels. Yes, in just one hour, hundreds of brave, age-appropriate pork bellions will run for their lives as thousands of squirrels run for their nuts. Three, two, one. Woo! You are now 11 years, 8 months, and 13 days old. Which means I am now officially old enough to run with the squirrels! And I am officially mom enough to tell you you're not. Say what? Johnny, I forbid you to participate in that festival. The running of the squirrels is too dangerous. No, it's not. Let's check out some highlights from last year's run. <laughs> I don't have any nuts! <laughs> I was told they weren't going to show that last one. Okay. Give me a minute to respond to that. Plus, the festival is insensitive to people like me with nut allergies. Is that why you didn't want Dad to go? That's one of the reasons. And now, here's the winner of this year's mascot contest who will lead the parade to our starting line. Hubert Test! Don't ever let anyone tell you your dreams can't come true, kids! See? Walnut Dad says dreams come true, and it's my dream to run with the squirrel. And you can't stop me! Perhaps she can. And don't even think about sneaking out! Yeah, she's playing hardball. I gotta get to that nut festival! Now, let's all head to the start of the parade! I might be an action hero, but you, giant nut man, are the real hero. I can't see anything. Peanuts! <laughs> He's the best town nut ever. To the parade! Hello? Uh, which way to the parade? Dookie's got to pee! Dog go, boy stay. Out you go, boy. So easy to trick. To the Nut Festival! Going somewhere, Johnny? Ah, darn it! The Nut Parade passes in front of our house on the way to the festival. Since I love you, you may sit here and watch your father tarnish the family name. But that's it. No squirrel run. Running of the squirrel starts in 30 minutes! How are we gonna get out of here? Mom not letting you run with the squirrels? What gave it away? The duct tape. Frankly, I'm surprised, little brother. You can't sneak out on Mom. She's upped her game. What? Mom 
mom is so easy to fool. <laughs> she could, like, never tape us up if she tried. She's right behind you. Oh. <laughs> Great. Now, none of us are allowed to go to the festival. Oh, we're, we're getting you to that festival. I was hoping you'd say that. <laughs> Hello? Is this the way to the parade? Ooh, horns! Must be this way. <laughs> I'm here! The town nut is here to lead the parade! <laughs> Operation Get Johnny to the starting line of the running of the squirrels, and Beat Mom begins now! Yes! Flying lawn chair. Ooh, nice! We thought you'd like it. Oh, no, they didn't. Sorry, Mom, but Johnny got away. Too bad you can't stop him. Was that our broom from the lab? I borrowed it yesterday, and you're both grounded. Okay, we zoom to the festival, sign up, and run with the squirrels. Yeah, but first we gotta outfly your mom. Cool broom! You're not going to that festival, Johnny. It's not safe. So you're gonna blast us? I'm okay. <laughs> Shoots down her own son. The same mom who has access to our backyard airbag system. And as soon as the town nut arrives, the parade to the running of the squirrels can begin. I hear the parade coming. Which means I'm running out of time to run with the squirrels. Is the cage really necessary? Never mess with a mom protecting her children. Have fun watching the parade, my sweeties. Uh, where did she get the crane? She wins. She beat us. I can't believe we lost a mom! Hey, what's that? Our universal remote control that remotely controls things universally. Now, we've got to time this just right. This ought to get us to the starting line quite nicely. Sisters rule. And moms drool. I gotta say, mom is impressive today. We're gonna make it to the... Uh-oh. Not again. Get back here, Johnny Tess, so I can keep you safe. Sign up, please. No! It's too dangerous. Mom, since this morning, I've jumped over a shark moat, had an aerial dogfight, and survived the TV-style car chase, and I'm fine. Hmm, I guess that's true. I'm not your little crazy boy anymore, Mom. I'm mature and crazy now. And I've got nuts! And I can't keep protecting my little boy. I mean, my young man forever. Okay, go run with the squirrels. Yes! Let the running of the squirrels get a begin!
Yeah, was it just me, or were these squirrels extra feisty this year? Don't worry. You'll get them next year, sweetheart. No, I think I'll just watch the parade. Duct taped on the lawn with you and Dad. Wait, uh, where is Dad? Yes! The town nut is free! Cool! I'm in the pork belly nut fields. The pork belly nut fields? Itchy butt? Nah, I feel like I'm forgetting something. Then shouldn't you be scratching your head? Huh? Oh, yeah, right. Hmm. Hmm. Please, try this. <laughs> nah, but I feel like I'm forgetting something. Oh, yeah, me too. Hmm. Hmm. <gasps> Do I have fleas? No, but I feel I'm forgetting something. Hmm. <gasps> it's Father's Day! How could we forget Father's Day? You were working on three computers, Susan and Mary were working on something that I'll test and possibly die on, and I was busy all week thinking about Bunt Cake. Welp, that explains it. By the way, can someone make me a Bunt Cake? Johnny, it's Father's Day, which means we have to do something for our father. I'll give him a slice. If I know your father, he's still in bed right now waiting for his Father's Day breakfast and gifts and... Wait on him! Thought they would have been here by now. Oh, wait. Hmm. I'm a terrible wife. Wait a minute. I did remember Father's Day two days ago. <laughs> oh, no, you don't, meet love. <laughs> nope, not done. So, what does the best dad in the world want for Father's Day? Oh, don't get me a thing. All I need is the love of my family. Great! He doesn't want anything. This is perfect. Yeah, we'll just go upstairs, tell him we love him, and not give him anything just like he wanted. <laughs> we can't do this. Why? Because your father said he didn't want anything because he wanted to sound like he didn't want anything, but in reality, he really wants something, and again, we don't have anything! Parents are weird. Wait till we get old. Honey, is that you? Should I come out now? Or should I stay in bed in case I faint from all the amazing stuff my wonderful wife and my amazing kids got me for Father's Day? <laughs> she froze with guilt. It happened to me once when I realized I peed in the cemetery. And the time I caught that squirrel I never thought I'd catch. But he did walk again. Do not come out, Dad. Unless you want to ruin the best Father's Day of your life. No, I don't want to do that! And just to be clear, you said you didn't want anything for Father's Day, but you really do want something for Father's Day, but you just want it to sound like you didn't want anything? Yeah, that's right. Hmm. ta -da! We need a gift. There's got to be something in this lab he'll love. Turbines, ectoplasma, plutonium... Oh! How about this box of discarded lizard tails? Nah, I got it! How about a serum that turns your midsection into a super spring? Does it work? It works. No, we need to give him something that dads can't live without. How long will it take to make him a plasma TV? Too long. Wait! How about... Robot Dad! You made a replica of your dad? Replica? Mom, Robot Dad is in many ways a huge advancement in analog patriarchal standards. Dinner time! My darling. 
You're right. He is better. You mean Dad will love having an extra better hand around the house to free him up to do more fun things like not cook meatloaf? I love you kids and doing your laundry and drawing baths for your mother. He's perfect. Uh, I mean, do you think your father will freak when he sees his new Father's Day gift? Only one way to find out. I can't wait! Are you ready for a Father's Day you'll never forget? <laughs> yep! Say hello to your very own robot, you! He does all the hard work in the house so you don't have to. We've been working on it for weeks because we remembered Father's Day. Hmm? Uh, I... Uh, I love it! And you didn't freak out when you saw it! Happy Father's Day, Dad. I have been relocating! Eliminate! 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 Didn't see that coming. Whoa. I guess we didn't think about how the robot dad would react. Something. One self-destruct mode coming up. Well, if you thought that was fun, Dad, wait till you see what else we have for you. On the Father's Day, you will never forget. Is it violent? Hmm. No, it's your own own. Hmm. It's your super special Father's Day breakfast. Really? That sounds great. And it's coming right up. Okay, who knows how to cook? I think this is called a spatula. Great! How do you use this spatula? Step aside! I took a cooking class to get an easy A. Dad loves meatloaf, so let's make him a meatloaf he'll never forget! Of fun. Huh? Now, let's surprise your father. Ooh, meatloaf? Yes! I can't wait to eat it! <laughs> huh? DNA. But he did look really surprised. We are a better family than this, and your father deserves better. I read somewhere that men love getting things in middle age that they were denied as kids. Has Dad ever mentioned anything he wanted when he was a kid? <gasps> yes, he always wanted a cat. We love you, Dad. Now open your Father's Day present. It's something you've always wanted. Really? Open it, open it. <laughs> Close it! Close it! Maybe we should have done a background check at the pound. Get some bandages and ointment. Look on the bright side. This will definitely be a Father's Day your dad will never forget. <laughs> Dads deserve a day of relaxation with some classical music while we do all your chores. It's your best friend, Willie Keeler, from when you were 10. But we ended up hating each other when I stole his girlfriend in high school. Yeah, you never mentioned that. I've been looking forward to this day for 22 years. Don't steal best friend's girlfriends in high school, Johnny. Got it. Okay. What? No. Oh. Happy Father's Day! I told you he wouldn't like it. Happy 
Happy Father's Day! We're so sorry, Dad. We just wanted today to be really special. Because you're so special to us. But we were so busy, sweetheart, we forgot to plan for your special day. I just want to set the record straight. The next time I say I don't want anything for Father's Day... I really don't want anything for Father's Day! Oh. Well, one thing's for sure. This is a Father's Day you'll never forget. <laughs> And the best gift I could ever get is a family that loves me so much. We love you, Dad. Ow, ow, ow. <laughs> Who puts an eject mode on a hospital bed? We'll be okay. He said he loved us. Happy Father's Day.